Hey guys, this is DT Gaming. So I would like to talk about ground bait. Um, and what ground bait really is is actually uh, allows you to attract fish into the area that you're fishing. Um, so for this video purpose, I am going to make uh, a bit of ground bait here. I'm going to use ground crackers. I'm not going to add no additives because I'm going to use this for uh, showing how to use ground bait. Okay. So, what you want to do before you start throwing the ground bait, um, you want to um, you want to basically uh, Figure out where you'd be cast, and so we're gonna cast about 60%. And you can see that's not really that far, but now when you try to throw the ground bait, that's a different story. Now we're gonna try 60%. As you can see, it threw way far. So, what you wanna do is uh, throw half that, so do about 30%. See? So if you're casting 60, throw 30%. So if you want to say that you want to um, get 50. Say that you want to throw. So let's say we're going to cast this about 70%. So now we're going to take a ground bait. And then we're going to throw this about 70%. See? That actually should have reached where I cast it at. Now, if you want to throw further, just hold it in up until where you can't hold no more. Just throw it that way. Or you can um, shift and click to uh, throw it further. So just um, look at your distance, how far you're throwing. So the further, the harder, uh, or I say, the longer you hold the button, the further you're going to throw the ground bait. The shorter you hold the button, the shorter you're going to throw it. But that's what you want to do. Throw your bait first. Figure out where you're casting. And if you're doing um, float fishing, um, so you can say on the telestick, you see I cast 60%. Um, and ground bait, you just, cast, you just throw 30% instead of 60 That should reach where your bait is. Okay, now there is other things to know about ground bait. Now say that if you want to throw it farther than you're able to by hand, there are tools for that. There is cobras, allows you to throw. These are throwing sticks. And then there's slingshots. Slingshots allows you to load the ground bait in, and you can just um, use that to throw this. This is more popular for um, for the ground bait. And another thing is that this is important. Now about the ground bait, uh, I would max this out. Uh, get a few levels, get some ability points uh, of skill points sorry um and mix keep raising this the each upgrade increases the quality of ground bait so i got five so this allows me to make nine to ten quality now if you got like one and you decide to make it you're going to get like quality two or three ground bait and that's going to be less effective to attract fish the better the quality, the better chance of tracking more fish and bigger fish. But keep that in mind. So, 
raise this to five, I would recommend. And as for ground bait, there's already uh, pre-mixes made for templates, so such as the Barbel, uh, Blacking Grass Carp, Pre-mix, Carp, Crucian and Gibble, Eyed, Roaches, uh, Tent, and White Bream. So we're going to look at Crucian and Gibbles because this is going to be the first ground bait you're going to unlock. Um, all you need is the ground crackers, millet porridge, and sunflower oil. I think you only need about 5 or 10% to unlock this. Okay. So you're going to make that. What I do is um, just grab some ground um brown crackers okay and you're just going to make that over and over again to get to um get that then again i think it's already unlocked right from the start if i'm correct so you don't have to make no levels um anyways so you're gonna come here grab the ground cr crackers um milk porridge and tractant sunflower oil then you want to come back here go to ground bait click on crucian gibble and click on make see this is quality of nine and ten this is what you want for so make sure you get that uh that skill level to five and you'll be making this tech quality all the time anyways I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, make sure to hit that like button. You guys want to subscribe as well. I appreciate the support. Thank you all for watching. And I'll see you all next time. Bye, guys.